Hello children. In this video, we will learn to estimate the area of objects. There is a lot of chaos in Champapur today. This morning, a door has been found in the cave. But this door can only be opened by the hand of one of the villagers. The king of Champapur has entrusted Barbole uncle with the responsibility of finding the villager whose hand impression matches the hand impression on the door. Uncle immediately traced the hand impression on the door onto a paper in this way. This paper has similar squares of one square centimeter each. Uncle then counted the number of squares covered by the hand impression to find the area of the hand impression. It took a long time for uncle to do this process. And finally, he came to know that the hand impression is covering 130 squares. The side of each square is 1 cm long. Therefore, the area of this hand impression is 130 square centimeters. Now, uncle made grid papers using some other papers too by making equal squares of 1 cm long edges. Uncle first took the impression of Bunny's hand on a grid paper like this. I will need to find an easier process to find its area, thought uncle. Let me first draw as many rectangles and squares as I can in this shape. Saying this, uncle made three rectangles in this way in Bunny's hand impression. Now, I will first find the area of this rectangle. This rectangle has seven horizontal lines and each line has five squares in it. This means there are seven times five or thirty-five squares in this rectangle. This rectangle has two horizontal lines and each of the lines has three squares. That means this rectangle has 2 times 3 or 6 squares. And this third rectangle has 4 horizontal lines and every line has 2 squares. It means there are 4 times 2 or 8 squares in this rectangle. Now, in the end, I will count the number of remaining full half and more than half squares, thought uncle. Uncle also found these numbers in this way. Now, uncle added all these numbers to find the total number of squares. In this way, there are a total of 63 squares in the bunny's hand impression. In other words, the area of bunny's hand impression is 63 square centimeters. But this is not the same as the hand impression on the door. So, uncle continued his search and now traced Appu's hand. Children, the impression of Appu's hand is shown here. Can you find the area of Appu's hand by the process used by uncle? If you wish to, you may find it by stopping the video. You can also find the area of Appu's hand impression by making rectangles in this way. The area of Appu's hand impression is 130 square centimeters. Appu's hand impression matched the impression on the cave door. 
the king opened the door with appu's help and gave him half of the treasure in return children in this video we learned to estimate the area of objects in the next video we will learn more about it through some interesting examples